This is a short video that shows how to configure the AL88C on the Copperland network. So I've opened up the Copperland manager and I've maximized the window and uh, you'll see it's very simple. First thing you have to do is choose your network card. So that's on the settings uh, sub window here. And as soon as, uh, for example, on my network, I have a few options, but if I, as soon as I choose the proper uh, uh, Ethernet interface, well, actually the one that's connected to the same network as the AL88C, uh, it shows me the all the devices that are on that network. So on this network, I have three computers and one AL88C. So this little video is about the AL88C. The only thing that you really have to do is from the overview screen is to click on the little triangle here that to show sub devices. And as soon as you do that, the screen reformats and you're presented with a series of in and out ports, which uh, I, I suggest that you rename them to, uh, to know and to show which instrument is connected to what. Of course, this is MIDI, so there's no way for a um, standard MIDI connection to know what is connected to it. So you have to do that part of the work. Renaming a port is as simple as clicking on it and then clicking on rename and changing the name. So I do keep the port number because I find it easier to in, in logically link the instrument to the port number. And then I always put from or to in front of the instrument so I know exact at a glance what configuration is applied to that instrument. So for example, in this case, I have the Vortex, which only has an output port. So it's from the Vortex to MIDI in one. Uh, MIDI out one is not used in this uh, sample setup. So my SCB 1010 pedal boards are connected to MIDI in two and etc. for all the, uh, the connections that I have for this setup. And that's it. The, what you might want to do, what I did, I went into the edit mode so back on top in edit and I've changed, I clicked on the uh, AL88C and I've changed the settings and I disabled the active sensing just to reduce uh, some of the MIDI traffic on the network and I don't use uh, active sensing anyway. So that's a MIDI feature, that, that's, that's your choice. There's nothing else to set up really, that's, it's that simple.